Hi, welcome to our Puso demonstration. I'm going to guide you how to set up a new account and go through some uh, features. Let's dive in. I'm going to log in. There are four, four main sections over here on the left. Post, channels, widgets, and collect. Post is, is where you'll see all the reviews once, once we connect some channels. So let's add our first channel. Um, I'm going to go with a uh, French restaurant. I'm gonna, we're going to add a Google business account. And this is the one. I'm going to add it. We're going to tag it um, Google. It's an option. Um, we can automatically approve five-star reviews. We'll leave it for now. I'm going to save. Here's the channel. I'm going to have an, add another one from TripAdvisor, a channel TripAdvisor. I'm going to paste the page, the URL of the page. Click Add. We're going to want um, the English reviews, I'm going to tag it TripAdvisor. And we're going to leave it for now. All right, so I have two, two channels. That means that the system is now collecting reviews from these channels. It will monitor from, for new reviews as well. And they will be available here, as you can see. We have the Google reviews, and it might take some time. Let's see if we have some TripAdvisor. Not yet, but it will be soon. All right. I'm going to go to the Google channel, I'm going to turn on automatically approve posts with five-star reviews. And, and this should automatically approve all the five-star reviews I have in, in the inbox in posts section. We'll save channel. Let's go to posts. Oh, we see that TripAdvisor reviews already in. And here are some Google reviews, but not the five-star ones. Five-star ones are now approved. They can be found here. All the reviews in the Approved tab are the ones that will be available inside the widgets on your website. So um, let's, let's add another channel. Let's add Yelp. I'm going to paste the URL. Here we go. Take a few seconds, a minute. All right. So let's tag this as Yelp. And Turn on automatically approve posts. Let's see what we have here. All right. The approved tab now has Yelp and Google. And let's add some TripAdvisor. Let's go to Inbox. Let's manually approve some posts, this one, and this one, okay, this one, this one, and this one. Mm. This one you can dismiss the one, the one that you know, we don't want to see. Let's approve this one and this one. All right. So we have, we have approved reviews from Yelp, 
TripAdvisor, and Google. So let's create some widgets. When I the widget, there are a few types of widgets to choose from. I'm going to choose the flash one and I'm going to put it site wide. This, this small thing is, will float at the bottom left or bottom right of the website whenever I choose. And I want to put it all around uh, on all pages on the website. All right, so that's it. Here's the widget. It's going to flash and, and change to all the other reviews that we approved. And this is the code that um, needs to be integrated on the website. If you have WordPress, uh, there is a plugin, a plus plugin that's easily installed and embedded. So um, on that page, there are some customizations. And on content, you can select which reviews to show on the widget. For example, if we want only Yelp reviews, we choose the Yelp tag and save. And here we see only Yelp. Switch to another review. All right. We click on it and we see the entire review. And that's that's how it will look on, on the website. We can change position to right, for example. We'll be on the right side. Cool. Now let's go to collect. Let's collect some reviews. Um, you can send this. You have a unique link. You can send that to your uh, clients in order to collect reviews. And the default one will be this form. This form to collect reviews that will go to Repuso dashboard post. But you can ask for reviews for uh, different places like TripAdvisor. Let's add a review source. Currently, we have only Repuso. We can add a new review source. It's going to be TripAdvisor. And here is going to paste the link to leave a review. There are some customized options here. Let's save. All right, so now this link will go and, and look like this. So the client can, can choose where to leave the review. Now, we have a routing option. Routing option lets you send the good reviews to TripAdvisor and the, the bad reviews to Repuso. So on your social channels, you'll see you most likely, likely get only good, good reviews. So how, how is that done? We go to routing and we enable it and we hit save. All right, so now the client will see this one. How was your experience? Of course, it's customizable. And when the click could be better, it goes to Repuso. Let's... All right. And when this, they click on good experience, they go to TripAdvisor. You can add more, like more review sources here, anyone you want. And you, we, can, we can customize the text. And this way you can increase your positive reviews on your social channels. And let's hit save. And we have this nice link that we can embed on emails or send in automated uh, marketing emails used to collect, collect reviews. That's it. Thank you.